<laughs> so our oh, concluding sorry, video, second. our second Wait, video no. for Make Kit Food. Mm. You can find them online at makekitfood.com. Stuffed peppers this time around. Mm. So if you haven't watched our first video, the link is up there. We made an amazing uh, meal. I can't actually remember <laughs> what it was. What was it, the last one? It was... Oh, the jackfruit crab jack cakes. Jackfruit... Um, crab cakes that were crab. Crab cakes with Thai... Yeah, they were like crab... With um, Thai chilli. Yeah, sweet chilli. Mm. Sweet chilli. What I'm excited about is this almond feta. Almond feta? I've never had almond feta, but... No. It's weird, isn't it? Because it does look like feta. Yeah. I'm really excited about this couscous because it smells so good. Again, this one was really simple, wasn't it? It was really easy. Probably easier than the other one. Mm. They're really nice flavours. Mm. And what I love about these is, these peppers are still firm. Yeah, but not too firm. I never was a massive fan of feta. I'd have it for a while and then I just found the taste really overpowering when mm. I used to eat it. But this is just a, like, a really nice flavour. So I'm going to try it on its own. I would never have thought that was almonds. I'll try a bit by itself. Mmm. It's nice and garlicky. Yeah, I was thinking that. It hasn't got that... What I always remember was better was I'd eat it and be like a bit too strong for me. Mm. But that's a really nice flavour. Ras El Hanu? I've never heard of that. It's, it's really nice. It tastes a bit cinnamony. Cinnamony. And again, I feel like I've learned something. Mm. Because I would never have done stuffed peppers with that mixture. No. Because you add the spices to boiled water and then add the couscous. Yeah. And then raisins and... Oh, yeah, this is good. I just love the fact that this company, A, is vegan food. Well, mostly vegan. It does mostly be vegetarian, vegan. Yeah. doesn't it? But I just love the fact that it's really pushing the make food from scratch thing yeah. and healthy food. I mean, that's a balanced meal, isn't it? Oh, God, yeah. And that's, actually, that's enough for me. Mm. I'm oh. really impressed. I just love those flavours. Because mm. I eat a lot of couscous when I have roasted vegetables. Mm. I know a lot of people can't have couscous. Because of the wheat. Mm. I think it takes nicer than quinoa. Yeah. I like quinoa, but a lot of people don't. You don't. Mm. <laughs> Has anybody guessed I don't? <laughs> yeah. You've got a real thing about quinoa. It's like quinoa's been really mean to you. Name. <laughs> <Quinoa>. <laughs> or quinoa. <laughs> I remember when I first found out about yeah. quinoa, I used to call it quinoa. Well, yeah, so I think everybody did. <laughs> no, darling, it's quinoa. Probably so, fully approve of that. Check out this really cute folder. So they send you this folder, and inside you have the recipe cards for the food that you've ordered. Mm. So the more meals that you buy from them, might be a little crafty little ploy, but I think it's a great plan. You obviously have a little binder of recipes. But that also means that, you know, you can refer back to it because obviously you're not going to have their mixture of spices and you're not going to have mm. the spicy mayo. But say you want to do something similar. Yeah. You've got the instructions to do something similar. Although, to be fair, the spices and the chilli mayo and all of that, you're missing out on, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. If you don't have their spices. But I think it's really nice that you've got that binder that you can look through them and you can go... You know what, I really like that meal. I've got a few of the ingredients, I'll just make something similar this yeah, week. Yeah, exactly. But I think you can always go back to it though, even mm. if you don't use their food. Mm. You're more than likely going to order more oh, yeah, food I think, because yeah. of the convenience, because it's a lot easier, isn't mm. it? Than having to buy a bulk load of food that you waste half of. And that's the point with Make Kit, is that they're really trying to cut back on the idea of wasting food. I can do that quite a lot because and I try not to. That's why I make so many big batches of soup and yeah, things. Yeah, yeah, and put it in the freezer. Because I find that I will buy food on, say, a Saturday or Sunday, and then suddenly end up going out on the two or three nights a week and miss out. Jeremy's got his now. He's just yeah, he's just walked popped off. To his <laughs> what have you got? Have you got your pepper? Yeah, just, I've taken two peppers. Is that? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we send him to the Jeremy <laughs> hole. <laughs> He's in his own little void. Oh. <laughs> Bless him. He still won't come on camera. It's really annoying. Mm. He won't come on his camera. little cubby. <laughs> come on. Can you just say that again? Polly is in. No, I can't. No, say it again! Polly is the intelligence of London vegan. Yes! Oh, that's the timer going on. Oh. 
all listen to that. So, end result, what right. was your verdict? Well, yet again, I think you could tell, hopefully, Phil, we'll edit this together so you're not just watching <laughs> us not talking and stuffing our faces. But that was so nice. And again, the flavours were lovely. That, what was it called again? It's the Ras El Hanu. Ras El Hanu. Ras Cuscus. El Hanu. I've never had that flavour before, and that's just so gorgeous. Like a just... curry, but not, because it had the sweetness of the cinnamon. Isn't it Moroccan? It is Moroccan, And it's yeah. so fragrant. And the pumpkin, I love pumpkin seeds, and they're so good for you as oh, well. I love pumpkin seeds when you mm. roast them, when you toast them. Roast put, them, toast Put them over a hob for a couple of minutes, and then they pop, they go flying. Put them over a hob, eh? So yeah, 346 calories per portion, mm. and we had half a portion there, yeah. I think, didn't we? Uh, 15 grams of protein and 12 grams of fat, and three of that is saturated fat. So it's really low in saturated fat, really healthy. Yeah. Really, and I just, it, and again, it was so fresh. I don't feel, because we've now just made two of the making yeah. meals, and we've had like half portions, but I don't, we don't. You don't feel uncomfortable. No, and I feel like it's really fresh, healthy ingredients, and I feel, I could happily eat that yeah, again too. and again and again. So well done, guys. I've forgotten about right, stuffed peppers. I never make them because no. I never know what to put in the yeah. peppers to stuff them with because I think you've got to get that balance because mm. otherwise they're just really dry because I've made a lot of stuffed peppers and they've been really dry They before. won't dry at all. They won't dry. They it's were. because that, that, what's it called? <laughs> the Hazrael Ranu. Hazrael Ranu. So it's a stock cube with mm. olive oil, lemon juice. It's the lemon juice. Salt and pepper yeah. and the, um, the powder. So well done, make it food. I make it. Yeah. Really. They made it. Love that. I feel like they did make it for us, even though we spent quite a while in the kitchen. I feel like. But the second one, actually, the, the stuffed peppers took no time at all. Yeah, it was quite, quite an easy one to make, wasn't it? And it really flavourful. It's and really, really nice good. to have that advice, though, on what to flavour your mm. food with, because that's where I go wrong. I can put a, a meal together easily, but it doesn't always taste like it's a special meal. So and that did, feel, that did taste special. And the cut, and one thing, you. I've read about you eat with your eyes. Yeah. There's something about bright greens and reds. Well, it's um, just, it just looks so pleasing. Antioxidant food, isn't it? Oh, that's true, yeah. Like, Very I, good for you. But it just makes you feel like I'm eating something healthy. Yeah. And I'm eating something really good for me. So you can check them out online at makekitfood.com. Mm. And you can check us out online at londonvegans.com, obviously ldnvegans.com. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Thank you, bye bye. See you next time. <laughs> and the colours, oh, like yeah. actually just photographing and filming them. The oh, cut. <laughs> She's in oh. demand. No, it's my friend. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>